Premiere and import a video and create a composition. And this is a video clip from I download from YouTube. And I just set in and out for this area. Now, so so just import your video for freeze frame. So you can import your gym related video, anything like this athletic video so we need to frame hold frame here so if you right click and here is two option you can see add frame hold and insert insert frame hold option so we can check the difference so if i click add frame hold after that everything is still so everything is hold so i just undo control z so this is the frame and frame hold and if you right click and insert frame hold segment it is a different op option so they freeze the frame then again start the video Con the continue the video this is the difference of uh, add frame hold and insert frame hold segment so we can increase the uh, length of this freeze frame and everything we can adjust the duration of this frame so this is the basics so we can add a lot of extra elements in here like callouts and pop-ups like a lot of items so i just download my callout title this is my advanced callout title so you can download the callout title from this description link and if you go down that if you and some people uh, commented they can download the file so if you if you can download the file just go to private mode chrome incognito mode so you can check it and install in premiere you can also get the file how to install video in same and i just drag and drop the Carlo title into timeline then uh, I think you have to scale to you have to change scale to frame size so everything is fixed now uh, it's a lengthy callout so we don't need this duration so i just cut i just split the call out title at here control k for split also you can use razor tool and use the right stretch tool and you can also use speed and duration so i just stretch the video stretch the call out animation like this This is the basics. If you, you you know the how to use the rate stretch or instead of rate stretch, you can use speed and duration option. Right by right click. Now I adjust the advanced color titles. You can adjust the stripe roundness from here and opacity and adjust the point point to position. So. just like this I need to change the point to position to tire area so it's based on your video you can adjust your call out and one more thing you can I will show another thing how to use this option in different ways so I just adjust this position and everything like this now I have to create a so just copy this color by old press and hold and click and drag so you can copy and just adjust the speed and duration and click on reverse speed so we need to create the out animation so that's why we are creating this duplicate and reverse the animation so just use the right stretch tool using R in keyboard and 
stretch the video like this so if you play you can see the animation like this so we have to animate the this color from here just change the flip so we have to animate the position value from here so add the keyframe in position and at the end frame change the position based on tire so sorry sorry you can change the position based on tire like in position adjust the position values like this now everything is okay and you can add lot of extra detail so one more thing i just delete this one not delete i just adjust the duration and timing so if you want some pop-up items for your character or for your object you can use illustrator so i just delete that one and just uh, export this frame into illustrator and adjust the illustrator composition so you know illustrator artboard size you can use the shift o in keyboard so just select the image and control 2 i think to just lock the image so i have to create a outline for this car and you can instead of in illustrator you can use the premiere pro pen tool so you don't need to you don't need to come illustrator but i like illustrator it's very easy to create shapes and everything that's why i'm that's why i'm using illustrator so instead of this illustrator you can use uh, the same thing in premiere using pen tool so just create a shape like this and change the color into red and uh, unlock the image by control alt 2 and select the you can here alt control 2 and delete the image so we need only this shape so save this shape as illustrator file in desktop and change the name into car and import this illustrator file into premiere and drag and drop into timeline so adjust this shape like this now just to increase the just to zoom the program window and adjust perfectly now we have to add an animation in opacity so at the starting opacity 0 and add a keyframe here and go forward a little bit and increase the opacity into 30 or 25 something like that and again go forward little forward and opacity into 0 then select last two keyframe and control c copy that and control v and again control v and again control v so at the end you need to adjust this keyframe so it's a uh, we have so we got that uh, flashing style animation that's why we are using we are adjust the keyframe in opacity if you are playing you can get like this and you can add the same both uh, car color and uh, the, this overlay same time so hope you enjoy it see you with another really exciting video